film him first, stupid, and you say, How about and he's going to tell you cut, why we're here. Cut. <laughs> Let's roll it. This is Jimmy Sutton, WKRP, uh, Hillhead News. Um, today we've had a uh, just a, a moment of joy amongst this rainy, dreary day. A young man from Bamberg, South Carolina, came to Hilton Head going into Fusk Island to play golf today, and he set a world record. Did not know when he got out of bed this morning that he would be in Guinness Book this week, but he will. Get this, 75 hush puppies. Now this is mostly, here's, Let me show you. we want to show you what they look like. So if you can get a close up of this. This is, <laughs> this is a hush puppy. And I think one of our uh, anchors, Lee Hughes, said he, we had 100, 200 at the table. I thought it was 150. So his record could even be more than 75. But <laughs> without further ado, <laughs> we're going to interview Mr. Moore from Bamberg, South Carolina. Dan, how does it feel to be in the Guinness Book? Well, I came here tonight. I, all I want to do is come down here and play golf. And I had no idea who was going to eat such good hush puppies. Have you ever ate any hush puppies that good? Uh, no. See, I'm I'm from in the low country around around Bamberg, and they don't have hush puppies like that around them parts. And you showed that today. <laughs> I can honestly say, I've never seen a man go through hush puppies like that before in my life. Well, I thought I'd only had about five or six. I didn't realize it was as many as y'all said it was, but. It was pretty good. Well, it, there's, you know, we have unconfirmed reports that it may be more than 75. If they, yeah. uh, we're going to have to call Norbert back at the restaurant and get the final tally on how many bowls that we did have at the table. But we we thought it was 150, and you ate roughly half of those. Now we're here, and it may have been 200, and if you prayed roughly <laughs> half of those, you have shattered your own record in one day. I just don't, I just can't explain the joy I feel right now, and, and it, and it was, it, it, it was good. Well, the biggest honor came when they put a drawing up on the board of a big fat stick figure. <laughs> 75 hush puppy t-shirt on. I hear they've already started taking reservations for more people are gonna try to break your record. And if they do, they get a t-shirt with that on it. How you feel about uh, having your, your name immortalized in Hudson's down there? I, I like it. I just hate that the picture looks so much like you. And I... <laughs> But I guess with my name under it, it does say that, that I did it, but I, I did hear that they've already started making t-shirts, so I have you to thank for that, and, and I appreciate you pushing this forward, and, and hopefully we can sell them and, and make a few dollars for a good charity. And buy some more hush puppies. Well, Miss Miss Jack and Lantern said she's going <laughs> she's going to line all that up, and uh, all, all proceeds will go to charity. But we just want to say on behalf of uh, WRBC, congratulations on the Hush Puppy record. And what well, everybody wants to know, uh, when are you going to come try to come back and break? Um, well, I, I guess when I can get all my friends together and we can do it again, I, I, I guess I'll I'll try it next time. <laughs> Congratulations, <laughs> you big belly son. <laughs> Phil, what a, what, a, what a tremendous day to be down here in Hilton Head for this unbelievable occasion. I, I just can't believe I'm part of it, you know, and uh, I, it's just amazing. You I'd want say, another hush puppy? 75, you got another one? <laughs> 75. Well, anyway, that's going to wrap it up from here in Hilton Head. Uh, back to you, Phil, in the studio.